So I just wanted to uh, make a video really quickly about some things that are going on with uh, this uh, this guy and uh, his Facebook post that I've seen. Uh, he says, hey, I'm single. Now my girlfriend that I was engaged to cheated on me. Um, uh, if you know anyone uh, single, hook a man up. Thanks. Um, yeah, a lot of guys have been through this, but there is a there is a differential uh, differenti uh, differentiating treatment between women women and men. Uh, if uh, a woman is recently single, a lot of times men will throw themselves at her uh, for an opportunity, um, and basically this equates to um, an invasion of a castle or whatever where a group of invaders is trying to enter in they cannot get in because the person in charge of the castle of the castle um, basically blocks all access and then uh, the would-be invaders basically frivolously throw their spears at the wall of the castle trying to I guess attack the people in um, this isn't completely a good analogy it's not it's not really good However, it just shows an, ex uh, an exercise in futility. Uh, that's what they both have in relation. Okay, various other people, they say, they say typical stuff. Damn, that sucks, man, sorry. <laughs> and this guy here, <laughs> uh, this guy here uh, you know, says, why bother? They're not worth dating anyway. They're ashtrays, ink billboards, fishing lures, overdrafters of you as, uh, at you as an ATM. They're not worth the trouble. Yeah, yeah. Uh, she cheated on you and you were engaged with her. Uh, you'd be surprised how common that is. Uh, okay. Uh, but yet yeah, uh, it is our gender uh, that gets shamed on TV and movies and everywhere else for cheating. Face it. You got your bubble popped. That fantasy land that you were living in where you uh, weren't aware of female hypergamous nature has now gone away. Also, there's stuff. Um, some girl says... Uh, um, uh, well, on that note, sorry to hear, Kaylin. Uh, you're better off. You'll find the right gal. Just stay away from the bars. Them gals be crazy. Laugh out loud. And another dude uh, basically um, offers advice to degrade um, the person who had been cheated on. He says, dude, get on Craigslist, and you can find someone on there for a relationship or just a friend. They got both. Okay. So it's basically... It's basically the equivocal. Well, well, just well here. Well, this dealer's got the heroin you want, and, and you'll be happy. And and then yeah, and just just don't stop shooting up, you know, cause cause reality's too hard to deal with. And meh. So anyway, um, this person says you need to quit the man hating. Why? Cause I told, you know, like because it's, I mean like. I get told this like all the time, you know, like by people, you know, when I tell them to wake up to how women's nature is, then, you know, I get labeled as a man hater, and apparently this person did too. And it's like, I agree, there aren't, there are not very many incentives to get married. Maybe that's why marriage is breaking down. Okay, um, here's this ongoing thing since yesterday, basically. Um, no, no, since, uh, well, basically since yesterday, Friday. Um, and, uh... <sighs> Alright, uh, anyway. So, I'm t you know, so, like, I tell people to stop, you know, just stop the drug, okay? And this person told them, like, don't even bother dating and all that. Okay. And then, uh... Oh, how many people have you dated before anyway? Before like, oh, so so you have to so a guy has to date at least four women to become an expert on this stuff. Really? Mm. Um. Anyway. It's dumb. Um. Yeah. Oh, degrade the man by having him go through online dating or whatever. Hmm, that's great. Do women want to go through that? No. All right. Um, whatever. Booty 
call. Yeah, exactly. Why is it hate? You know, oh, when feminists do all their shit, it's called fighting for justice. Exactly. I mean, it is. And I agree, it is a drug addiction. There's so many similarities. Oh, you have issues you need to go to the fucking mental health institute for. Hmm. Oh, and then another person says, uh, yeah, you need to go to a mental institution. Oh, look at this, a fucking Naywalt. Dude, not all women are like that. Really? Well, why the fuck are all men like that? Well, men are sex perverts, and don't, and, and men shouldn't be elementary school teachers because they might fuck a kid in the ass. Man. So, so just carte blanche, total blanket, absolute distrust of the male gender um, seems to be approved by society because we've got to protect women and children. God damn. And then... Oh, but but don't distrust women as you know. Don't no no. That that's evil, man. Okay, here's more of this stuff. Um. Oh, I'm sure somebody will give you a fix someday. Just keep just keep on being addicted to the drug. It gets better, man. And it just oh my gosh. I mean, well here, just like, I mean, I'll, I'll just scroll through it and let you see what all has ensued. <sighs> it just, it just never ends. I mean, it just, oh my gosh. I mean, you see how a person who begins to, you know, wake people up to how things really happen and just says, Dude, don't don't date. Don't like don't involve yourself with women. It's not worth the risk. You know, and then that person is labeled as a hater. So it's hatred to tell women I mean so so it's regarded as hatred to tell men not to involve themselves with women, you know, because it's hatred against women. Meanwhile, oh here's another person. Oh you yeah, you do you need help, man, man. And then, I'm sure you'll find someone, I'm sure you'll find somebody someday. Yeah, I, I used to hear that a lot. Yeah, are women so freaking mentally fragile that they have to be fucking catered to all the time? It's just, yeah. I mean, uh, I mean, like, what can I say more? I mean, look, this this person already said it. I just, oh, we're halfway there. Now down here, coming up here at the bottom. Yeah, I agree. Yeah, here's how things will likely go for you. Based on observation of several men. Yeah. Oh, yeah, the one dude, uh, you know, offered more shaming stuff, you know. Why don't you just go gay? Man. Guy, you're just ate up with hate. You know what? Oh, man, I see this now. That's how a girl is acting toward a guy. Dude, I'm going to start using that now. I'm going to start, oh, oh my gosh, next time I hear a woman bitch about fucking men are pigs, men are assholes, there's no good men out there, men are, men are, men are abusing all this, I'm like, girl, you're filled with hate. <laughs> oh, man. I'm, gonna, I'm learning from this, and many other men are going to learn too. They're going to learn that women are just not trustworthy. I mean, how, how many, okay, like... How many how many men does it or how many women does it take fucking over men before men realize how women are? I mean, society seems to be just fine with everybody seeing men as the enemy. Oh, and, and, and if you don't trust women, it's because you got a problem. Man. 
Oh, this is a good idea coming up here. Oh, man. Down here at the bottom. So this girl cheated on the dude. Uh, we're all going to be equal about this and go about and, and, and go harass her about her infidelity, right? So so the dude is going to become a famous singer who makes uh, uh, a uh, uh, makes a wealthy and successful career about being the victim of women's fidelity issues, right? Just like Taylor Swift and fucking um, uh, Kelly Clarkson and Beyonce Knowles. So this dude's gonna get a huge amount of sympathy from TV viewers and magazines like Sandra Bullock did, right? You know? It's like... No, Exactly. He's going to be expected to get over himself, stand back up, be knocked back down by another woman. Exactly. E exactly. Exactly. I mean, th seriously. I mean, th that's how it is. I mean, sure, w some women will say, oh, I don't feel sympathy for you. It's like, that's what the whole thing's supposedly about. No, why don't you just fix a fucking problem? I mean, goddamn. I mean, why don't people just treat people the way they're supposed to and have some kind of universal fucking standard no that's that's really bad that's like terrorism Meh. whatever anyway i'm done making this video right now um so uh so until next time validation warfare channel i'm manslave and uh enjoy